Hello, and this is Andrew Hoagland with Direct Business Marketing, and we're doing another webinar today. I'd like to welcome everybody. Another webinar today, I'd like to welcome everybody. Another webinar today, I'd like to welcome everybody. Have a little technical difficulty with a live webinar. Um, first, today we're going to go through pay per click advertising. This is something we get asked a lot um, uh, to talk about, and you know, we want to dispel some of the myths and go through some of the, the correct techniques. Um, that you should use with pay-per-click advertising. So first we're going to start off and answer this question that I would say we get asked um, all the time. <laughs> you know, the first question is does pay-per-click advertising work? And the simple answer is yes, most definitely pay-per-click advertising works um, if you do it the right way. There's definitely a wrong way to do pay-per-click advertising where you are just flushing your money down the toilet for lack of a better phrase um, your there's your chance of of success is very very low um, but overall if you do pay-per-click correctly um, uh, it's definitely successful so uh, next I want to talk about there's so many different places you can do pay-per-click and I guess maybe uh, I should take a step back and 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 talk about pay-per-click and what is it um, paper Pay per click advertising is pay per click, meaning you only pay if someone clicks on your ad. Um, there's really two, well, there's three really methods of advertising, paid advertising online. There's um, just standard monthly where you pay a monthly fee to uh, a website and, and your ad is shown um, as many times as possible. Um, then there's uh, um, pay per thousand impressions where you're you pay for uh, a thousand times your ad being shown and then there's the pay per click advertising which what we're talking about today uh, where you only pay if someone clicks on your ad and being in the direct response marketing um, having direct response marketing being the focus of of direct business marketing we think pay per click advertising is one of the best methods because the fact that someone clicks on your ad is, is, is a direct response, is eliciting a response from, your, from, the, from the user, and we like that going in. So that's a, that's a benefit. So you know when someone's looking at your ad, for the most part, they, they chose, to look, uh, to, chose to look at your ad. So that's important. Um, so having said that, let's talk about the different choices. So there's many choices of where you can advertise online. And I would say to boil it down, a simple way to determine where you should focus your, your pay-per-click efforts um, is to ask this question. Do your prospects go online searching for what you're offering? Um, so an example of this would be uh, um, if I, let's say I'm selling um, you know, motorcycle helmets or motorcycle parts, let's say. I'm selling some sort of widget. Um, then definitely yes, people go online and they're searching for the widget. Now if I'm selling um, a physical product that's new to the market, people might not be searching for that product online. You know, if you have a, a new gadget, it's new, no one knows to search on it, so that answer would be no. Um, if you have a service that people are searching for online, um, you know, maybe lawn care or termite control or, or something of that nature, real estate, you know, then the answer is yes, people are searching for your services online. Um, uh, a marketing mindset that we hold true is the concept that there's two different types of people online. There's what we call the action takers. They're online looking to take action. They're looking to do something, um, to either buy something, they're looking, they're searching out um, you know they're going to take an action they're motivated they're trying to solve a problem that they have whether the problem is they need a new phone or the problem is you know they you know they want to buy a movie or 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 they need real estate whatever they're looking to take action the other type of person is an info seeker they're just surfing the net they're looking for the answer to a question um, they're not looking to buy anything they're just looking for an answer um, you know I, I deal with this with I have four children I deal with this all the time the just crazy questions the other day was can can you eat a hippopotamus you know can you eat hippopotamus meat or can you he, eat a tiger or can you eat a giraffe you know, well, I was online looking for those answers. Can you actually do that? Um, and actually, most of the time, the answer is yes. There's a lot of websites out there selling wild game. If the 
species is endangered, then you can't buy it through normal channels. Just a little information for you. Um, so I was an info seeker. I wasn't looking to buy. I was just looking for the answer to a question. Um, so keep that in mind. What type of person um, uh, are your prospects? So, um, the, so having said that, if the answer is yes, so your prospects are searching online, then I would focus on the search engines, Google, Yahoo, Bing. Um, obviously Google being number one. If your prospects are not searching for your product online, then a good place to focus pay-per-click advertising uh, is, is Facebook. Um, we have a client who has a, a World War II book. Well, World War II uh, book is not something a lot of people search online for Google. It's more of a, a secondary item. Um, people do search for books on uh, online, obviously, but this industry wasn't something that a lot of people aren't looking for this type of book online. So we went to Facebook advertising. Because in Facebook, you can really narrow in and say, you know, I want to only have my ad show to people who are army wives or who are involved in the U.S. military. And those type of people would be apt to buy a book about World War II. Um, so think of that. So if you have a product or service that typically the person isn't searching online for, then you know, focus on Facebook because you can really na narrow your advertising down into people who probably would want to buy your, your product or service. Um, the next thing is, a uh, question we get a lot is budget. You know, I have a tiny budget. I don't have much money. You know, should I do pay-per-clicking? It, it costs a ton of money to do pay-per-click advertising. And the answer is that's completely false. It doesn't cost a lot of money to do pay-per-click advertising. Um, it only costs what you want it to cost. Um, there's all kinds of budgetary features that you can build in to all of these tools, Google, Facebook, etc. Um, and there's benefits to even doing a small amount of pay-per-click advertising outside of you know, someone buying your product or service. You can refine your message. You can really hone your message in. Uh, hone in on your message to people coming because you know, let's say you're getting, let's say you're only getting 20 clicks uh, a week from your pay-per-click. That would be a small pay-per-click budget. Well, you're still looking at, of those 20, how many people converted into a lead? What can I do on my, on my page to, to make that convert better? So you can really hone in your message. Uh, next, you're going to get valuable keyword data. Beside, you know, one thing that we do is keyword research, finding out what people search for online and what converts the best. Well, pay-per-click data is not research. It's hard data. This number of people searched on this term. Um, your ad was shown this number of times. You know exactly what to focus on from a keyword perspective. So that's very important. And, and obviously the obvious final thing is you're only paying for clicks. Um, so whatever you set your budget, you're only going to pay uh, for people that click on your ad. You're not paying for anything else. So I would say if you're not doing pay some sort of pay-per-click advertising, you know we have clients that start as little as as $200 a month and go up to you know tens of thousands of dollars a month doing pay-per-click advertising. Um, and it's just a simple math. If you start with $200 a month and the $200 is making you $400, you would increase that. So it's a, it's a good tool, and throughout the other parts of this series, we'll cover other aspects of pay-per-click advertising. Um, again, my name is Andrew Hoglum. I'm the Chief Technical Officer of Direct Business Marketing. I uh, thank you for joining the uh, webinar today. Here's my contact information. Um, one more thing, we have our Get Direct magazine, quarterly magazine that's out right now. Go to directbusinessmarketing.com slash get direct. So directbusinessmarketing.com slash get direct and fill out the form and download uh, that great magazine and check out the articles. Again, thank you for joining us today.